Hello guys, how to fix KV5040442 update failed to install in Windows 11. If you are trying to install Windows latest update and failed to install in your system, then here are the various workaround to fix this issue. And the first one is go to Windows settings, right click on a start button and choose settings. You may press Win plus I shortcut key. And here from the left side, go to system. Thereafter, go to right side and here you will find the option troubleshoot. Click on it. This is an inbuilt tool of Windows system. Choose other troubleshooters and run the Windows update troubleshoot. Click on run button against Windows update. Windows will now detect the issues and accordingly fix your issues if any Windows update related issue found in your system. Follow on a screen instruction to complete the process. The next workaround to fix this issue is disk cleanup. Go to Windows search and type disk cleanup. Open disk cleanup in your system. And here choose drive C and click on OK. A new window will open. Here make the check against tops and downloaded program files, temporary internet files, recycle bin, temporary files, thumbnail, etc and finally click on OK button. Are you sure you want to permanently delete this item? Click on delete this item. It will free your space and try to fix your issues. The next one is go to run command box in your system. Right click on a start button and choose run. You may press win plus R shortcut key to launch run command windows. And here type services.msc to open services windows in your system. Open services windows and in services windows, some windows update services start or restart. First one is background intelligent transfer service. Right click on it and first choose a start. If you already found it in a start mode, then restart it. Thereafter, apply a double click on it to open its property. Startup type as automatic. Finally, click on apply and OK to save the changes. Apply this method to for or other services. Go to cryptographic services. Right click on it. Choose restart. and apply a double click on it to open its properties and set a startup type as automatic. Finally, click on apply and OK to save the changes. The next one is Windows installer. Look for Windows installer services. Right click on it and choose restart. Apply a double click on it to open its properties and it's a startup type, you can't edit. And the last one is Windows Update Services. Right click on it and choose Restart. Apply a double click on it to open its properties and the startup type set as Automatic. Finally click on Apply and OK to save the changes. Restart your system and check whether your update installing or not. If not, go to the next fixes. The next one is go to Windows search and MD and open command prompt Windows run as administrator mode. Click on run as administrator. And in command prompt Windows, here execute some DISM tool to scan your system to check your system health. These three DISM tools execute one by one DISM scan health, DISM check health and DISM restore health. Apply all these three commands one by one followed by enter key on each time. And one successfully execution of these three DISM tool execute the command SFC scan now. 
type SFC space slash scan now. It will scan your system for any corrupted files that may restrict your Windows update. So scan your system, follow on screen instruction. It will take some time and 100% verification of your system. Once completed, restart your system and execute some Windows update components. First, stop these services. Execute these four commands one by one. Simply in, type in command from Windows and press enter each time. And after that, execute these two commands software distribution old and cater root old. One by one, execute these two commands also in your command prompt windows followed by enter key on each time. Thereafter, start all those services who have earlier stopped them. Execute these four commands to start all services. One by one, execute in your system command prompt windows and one successfully execution of this command, restart your system. If none of the above workaround fix your issue, then manually update your Windows, manually install your Windows update. Go to Chrome browser and here look for Microsoft update catalog. Open it. Open Microsoft update catalog. And in search field, type your update. Click on search. And all KV5040442 update related download will available. Simply download it and install it in your system manually.